in that ring last time. Thanks, y'all. I appreciate that. What's up, Wiley? Y'all feeling all right? I'm feeling all right. All right. I was a little nervous doing this. Y'all know usually I'm not really nervous, but I was nervous for this one. Four years ago, I was a freshman at Wiley College. I arrived here with a success, a, a, I'm sorry, an opportunity for success, granted by Coach Janet Eaton. Now, when I got here, I didn't want to become the next Miss Wiley. I didn't even want to be the captain of my team. I just wanted to leave Wiley knowing that it would have been a part of me when I left, and it would have a part of me when I left. <laughs> Nothing of the physical sense. I just wanted to metaphorically leave a part of myself here at Wiley. Now, I won't stand here and tell you that Wiley was a place for me, or, or that I came from a long line of educators that enforced the importance of HBCUs. But what I can tell you is who stands in front of you and why I'm here. Hello. Hi. My name is Mahogany Terry. Most of you know me as Mo. I'm a secondary math education major. I enjoy family guy marathons. I struggle to get up for 8 a.m. class. And I cross my fingers from Wednesday to Sunday that the Caps don't have a good day. I'm just like y'all. I'm a student who wants to unite her peers to take pride in our Wiley, because this is our Wiley, y'all. Right. I can genuinely call Wiley a home away from home and can say that I found my way here at Wiley College. I'm a witness of amazing things done by students and scholars who don't even know their potential and don't have a chance to show their potential. Right. I'm a reflection of y'all. I'm a reflection of a body of students who I know can change lives if only had a chance to be heard. Which leads me to the why I'm standing here part. I've seen so many speak in leading Wiley, but what I want to do is I want to unite y'all. I want to represent Wiley through excellence. The evolution of excellence, if you've been following my campaign. And I also want to offer y'all my apology. I apologize for not expressing myself and for standing silent for four years feeling like my voice didn't matter because it does just like y'all do now i'm not one for apologizing without action we have the power to unite as one for the betterment and excellent representation of wiley college this is a history rich institution y'all you just don't know let your voices be heard let your concerns your concepts your ideas your goals Everything, let that be known, let it be acknowledged. Let's unite to fulfill legacies and to impress ourselves. And that is exactly why I'm here, ladies and gentlemen. I stand firm for that. We as a student body need to be heard. Not via one person or a cabinet of team members. But thank you very much for your time, because they cut me. But I appreciate your vote, y'all. Mo for president. All right, everybody. Now